Amy Medford with Medford Knife and Tool Knives on the table today are headed to Chris Miller at KnifeJoy.com. He is online only. Check him out and let's see the crazy sexiness that is headed his way. All right, we're going to start down here at the Smooth Criminal end. So we have Smooth Criminal Flipper. And this one is S45VN. I love the logo on the S45VN for the Smooth Criminal. Beautiful hunter green handles with bronze hardware and clip. The second one, also a flipper, black handles with flamed hardware and clip. And the third one here, when I, the, you know, you'll notice just from the get-go, you see the flipper tab for the flipper and there's no tab for the auto. So that one's the Smooth Criminal Auto, also S45, blue handles, blue hardware and standard clip. Then we have the Praetorian Swift Frame Lock flipper. So Swift FL flipper. This is half aluminum, half titanium, S45 tumble drop point. So blue hard anodized aluminum handle. That's why this knife has limitations. We can only do so many hard anno colors. Looks like blue hardware and a blue clip. Just a lovely knife. It's got a nice thickness to it. It's got a very nice light weight to it. Just a fantastic everyday carry. Couple M48s. Much like the Swift Frame Lock, it is a hybrid of titanium and aluminum. So we have S45 PVD blade, a hunter green handle with bronze hardware and clip, and a PVD spring. So half titanium, half aluminum. The second M48 here is PVD blade, black handle, bronze hardware, and a PVD spring. So black and bronze. Now we have three of our Scout MPs. If you go online, you will see OD green and black only. So if you desire a different color, this is a factory direct reseller only purchase. So we have Coyote Tan handles with everything blacked out. Titanium liner lock, also PVD coated. Thick G10 slab, it's got the Betsy Ross flag on it. High vis orange. This one sports dark flamed hardware and flame clip. So not only do we do um, factory direct different colors for the Scout, we do upgrades in hardware as well. As you see on this one, it does sport bronze hardware and bronze clip. Then the micro T that has been sunsetted, don't know when it will come back. So we are shipping out existing orders and then we'll be taking a break. My guess is we'll take a break for two years. Who knows? So the first micro blackout drop point in S45 VN, just fantastic. The second one, rivets, star and bars. It's got a three stamped on the blade. So CPM 3V. And everything we do is CPM, D2, S34, everything. So I just don't mention it. It just flows off the tongue for 3V. So we have the star and bars and rivets, brushed and flamed clip with flamed hardware and a Vulcan drop point, beautiful. Second one, Vulcan Tonto, straight up tumbled handles, flamed hardware and clip. So if you want something kind of straightforward. And then the third one, custom sculpted with a dragon skin, violet and bronze, almost looks like cobblestone and flamed hardware and a brushed and flamed clip. Looks like we have its bigger sister here. Beautiful blade. I mean, the Vulcan blade finish on some of these is just outstanding. The color on this, we've got blue and violet and bronze. It's just very shimmery and gorgeous. Again, dragon skin with flamed hardware and brushed and flamed clip. The second Genesis T. So we have dragon skin and then we have dragon scales. The scales are the larger version. Dragon skin is a more tight, much tighter configuration. Bead blasted cement with brushed bronze flats. S45, gorgeous Vulcan Tanto blade. And then we have two full-size Praetorian tie here. So you can notice firstly the thickness of the blade. The, uh, it's hard to notice the grooves because most of them have been cleaned by the uh, Predator sculpting. I mean, I gotta tell you, the bead blasted OD green uh, is what I'm calling it with those brushed bronze flats Predator. Absolutely sick, I love it. The dark bronze hardware and brushed bronze clip, just absolutely stellar. Second Praetorian tie, satin Tanto blade. And this is the stained glass sculpting with the pen flame anno. So it's got that very watery, very cool watercolor, iridescent feel to it on stained glass sculpting. And it can be applied to both sides because it's not heat, it's a pen anno and a brushed and flame clip. Absolutely stunning. So again, reach out to Chris Miller at Knife Joy, see what you can get in your pocket today. Keep watching the videos till the next time. Peace.